So here's the big question. How are entrepreneurs like us, who have been hustling and struggling to make it to success, who seem to make it one step forward, only to fall two steps back, who are dedicated, determined, and driven, how do we finally break through and win? That is the question, and this podcast will give you the answers. My name is Brian Kelly, and this is the Mind Body Business Show. Hello, everyone, and welcome, welcome, welcome to the Mind Body Business Show. We have a tremendous guest for you tonight. You are going to love this guy. Maybe as much as I do. I don't know if that's possible because I love this guy. Marco Torres, he is in the house. He is waiting. He is in the wings and he's coming in to see you really, really soon. In the meantime, real quick, the Mind Body Business Show. What is that all about? It's a show that I had developed with you in mind. It's a show for entrepreneurs by entrepreneurs. And what does that mean? It means we are here. My purpose is to bring on incredibly successful people like Marco to help extract and elicit their models for success. So that when you hear what he has to say and you take those notes after the show's over, you can then implement the certain things that he's doing that has resulted in his success so that you can achieve success faster. You know, modeling, it's just a fancy word for copy. And every person I've had on my show is absolutely fine if you copy their approach to business because that is what entrepreneurs love doing is helping and serving others anyway. And so Marco is no different. I know just from chatting with him a little bit before we went live and I cannot wait to bring him on and share his brilliance with you. And the Mind Body Business Show, it the, the words in the title represent what I call the three pillars of success. And these three pillars came about as a result of my studying successful people and focusing solely on successful people for a period of about 10 years. And I realized three things kept bubbling up to the top for, you know, what are the reasons for their success? One was mind, which means mindset uh, to a person. Each of these successful individuals had a very rock solid and positive. But the most important part was flexible mindset. Hmm. I don't know if you saw that one coming. And there's body body. Interesting. To a person, every one of these successful individuals literally took care of their body. And I'm talking about through exercise and nutrition, what they're intaking. I thought that was very um, eye opening. And then there is business. Now, business is multi multifaceted. Uh, the thing with business is one must master various skill sets that are required to create a successful, thriving business, just as Marco himself has done. You know, we're talking skill sets like sales, marketing, team building, systematizing, leadership. I mean, I could go on and on. The cool thing is you don't have to master every single skill set. In fact, I don't know if you would have enough time on this earth to do that because mastering anything is like being an expert. You know, 10,000 hours is like the average, I think it is. The good news is if you just master one, one of those skill sets that I mentioned, it was actually one of the few I mentioned just a moment ago, then you really don't need to master them all. And that one skill set is leadership. That's right. So if once you master the skill set of leadership, you can now bring in other individuals who have mastered the skill sets that you have yet to or may never master yourself. And now you can leverage the brilliance of other people on your team and get to that success line, whatever that is for you, much, much faster. That is the whole purpose of this show is to help you to get to your level of success that you desire much quicker than doing it on your own. Please don't do it on your own. Listen to people like Marco Torres. And another thing that is uh, I found very intriguing with very successful people is that to a person, every single one of them were also very avid readers of books. So with that, I'd like to segue very quickly and then we'll bring the man, the myth, the legend himself on here real soon. I want to segue to a little segment I affectionately call Bookmarks. Bookmarks. Born to read. Bookmarks. Ready, steady, read. Bookmarks. Brought to you by ReachYourPeakLibrary.com. There you see ReachYourPeakLibrary.com. One quick word of advice. 
write that down, reachyourpeaklibrary.com, instead of going off and clicking away or typing it into your browser. I would hate for you to take your attention away, especially when our man Marco comes on and he's talking. I would hate for you to miss a golden nugget of his because your attention was elsewhere. Just write these resources down. I know he's going to have many for you. Every show guest does. Write them down and visit them after the show is over. So take notes on what he is saying during the show and all the resources and keep your gaze and attention on him and you will get far more out of it. I do. I talk about this when I uh, speak from stage. Uh, it's always best to stay in the room. I always say the magic happens in the room. I know there's no room here, not physical, but I think you get the gist of it. All right, reachyourpeaklibrary.com. It's, it's essentially a website that I had built for you. Whoever you are watching and listening, I'm not kidding. This was built for you. And why did I do that? I was not an avid reader myself until about 10 years ago, age 47. And what I found in my, uh, why, it was um, quite an awakening. I learned that reading the right books can really have a positive impact on your business and your life. And what I started doing was cataloging the books that I personally had read and completed. And then, so I vetted only a subset of books that would meet this list. And so they are all on this website. In fact, I've got some more I need to add. I'm falling behind on having them added. And they're in no particular order. Uh, they're not alphabetical. They're not by author. Uh, for the most part, you'll see a lot of Grant Cardone all lumped in there right now. Uh, but the purpose of it is just find one book that you have yet to read that's in this site and just get it and go read it. You don't have to buy it from this website. That's the purpose of this website is not for making money. Uh, you click on those buttons that goes to Amazon. You can get them for where, wherever you like. Just find the book that you like. Go find it or click on the button either way and read and read the next book because all of these books had profound impact on my life and I'm hopeful that they will of yours. And that's the reason I did this so that the odds for you are greater to have impact on you if they did already on another successful entrepreneur. Hopefully the same will be true for you and it just decreases the odds of your wasting any time. That is reachyourpeaklibrary.com. And speaking of not wasting any more time, it's time to bring on our guest expert, let's do it. Here he comes. Get ready. It's time for the guest expert spotlight. Savvy, skillful, professional, adept, trained, big league, qualified. And there he is, ladies and gentlemen. It is the one, it is the only, Marco Torres. Man, this is fun. Thanks for having me, Brian. <laughs> Yeah, it's going to be a lot of fun. a lot of fun, primarily because of you. Uh, you have a great personality. You're a lot of fun to talk to, and we're just going to have a, a blast here tonight. Um, and I've got a frog in my throat. All of a sudden, it'll go away. It will pass. So, real quick, uh, before we get into this, and before I give Marco the introduction he deserves, the proper introduction, a little bit of housekeeping. You see, right over his left shoulder, and it's on the right side of the screen as you're watching this live, the big insider secrets. They sponsor this show, and that enables us to give away on every show a five-night stay at a five-star luxury resort, and you're going to be blown away about how they're able to do that and where that actually comes from. I'll give you a little hint, and I'm pointing over at Marco. Yes, it's going to be a fun, fun time, so you'll want to stick around to the end. You want to, so you can enter to win that five-night vacation stay because the man drinking the water right there is going to provide you with an amazing, amazing um, experience wherever you want to go. That's going to be awesome. And then a couple more real quick ones, and then we're going to get real busy with Mr. Torres. Here we go. All right. If you're struggling with putting a live show together and you might find it overwhelming and you want a lot of the processes done for you while still enabling you to put on a high quality show, and connect with great people like Marco Torres, I am not kidding, and grow your business all at the same time, then head on over to CarpetBombMarketing.com. Carpet Bomb Marketing, saturate the marketplace with your message. And one of the key components that is contained in the whole Carpet Bomb Marketing process is one that you'll learn how to absolutely master. And it's the very service we use right now to stream this live show on the Mind Body Business Show 
And as you can see, it's called StreamYard. And over the course of the past nine years, uh, we have tried actually 10 now. <laughs> we have tried a lot of different of these quote unquote TV studio solutions for live streaming shows. And StreamYard, I have to tell you, is the best of the best. It, it combines supreme ease of use along with unmatched functionality. So write that URL down that you see on the screen. I'll say it out loud for those of you listening on podcast. It is ryp.im forward slash stream live. No spaces, all lowercase. ryp.im forward slash stream live. Write that down. Visit it after the show is over because the show is just now beginning because Mr. Marco Torres is here with us. Woo, I can't wait. This is going to be so much fun. All right, I'm going to give him a proper introduction, and then I'm going to finally ask him a question, and I will finally shut up. Isn't that nice? Because this show isn't about Brian Kelly. It's about Marco Torres. That's what this show is all about. I'm not kidding when I say that. Marco Torres is the founder of MarketingBoost.com. He has helped thousands of business owners worldwide boost sales and scale their businesses by as much as fivefold through the use of incentive-based marketing. He teaches entrepreneurs how to soar sales and marketing through the use of value add incentives. This is it's a phenomenal concept. I love it. And that's instead of discounts. His Facebook group is home to more than, listen to this, 27,000 active business owners who are raking in sales with his advice and amazingly affordable subscription program. We are going to get deep into that, I promise you. But now, formally and officially, welcome to the show, Mr. Marco Torres. Hey, Brian. Thank you for that introduction. It was awesome. I'm glad to be here. And 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 the introduction is finally over, huh? <laughs> <laughs> that was half the show right there. Yes, we do this every show. It's fun. I get to meet amazing, wonderful people like you. One of the things I like to open up uh, the questioning with is what I call the foundation of one's either success or lack thereof. You've obviously got the success going. And for that reason, I like to know what is going on in that big, beautiful brain of yours. Like, especially when you get up in the morning and, you know, being an entrepreneur can be arduous at times. It can be uh, difficult and challenging and things can set us back, knock us backward. And knowing that, and you've been through all this and you still go through it, it doesn't ever stop. <laughs> so for you, Marco, when you get up in the morning, what is happening in your brain that keeps you driven, that keeps you motivated, that keeps you moving forward day in and day out constantly? Thanks for that question. Now, gratitude is number one. You know, you get up and you step outside and I, I, I get up and I walk outside and I look at the sky and I'm like, thanks. I'm, I'm glad to be above ground. You know, I'm going to find things to be grateful for and uh, and then start the day from there. You know, uh, but it's all about being grateful first. And then I'll sit down and kind of meditate about what I got to get done today and what's important, what are the priorities, uh, kind of list them out and uh, get going. And, it's, and, and my mission is really, I learned this from Zig Ziglar book many years ago. It's about if I can help enough people get what they want out of life, I'm going to get what I want. And that's been working for me for decades now. I love that. And yeah, so I hope everyone's taking notes. I get I love asking this question. I, I open the show with a similar question. And I also close the show with a question I love going to as well. Uh, good book ends. And I hope everyone is taking notes because this could be the most important part of this entire show is what is going on in the mind, in the mind of a successful entrepreneur. If you want to be successful, then model everything. You know, as long as it's in your set of values, if it matches your set of values, and Marco's not saying anything that really doesn't seem that outlandish to me, but model those who are successful, copy what they do, mimic yeah, now, them. Brian, I don't hear too many people talk about that, but I love that. I heard you say that at the beginning of the show, and that has been my motto for decades as well. Uh, it's, uh, I, you know, been thinking about writing a book called Copy, Paste Your Way to Success. I mean, <laughs> Don't steal that idea. <laughs> I love that idea. No, definitely don't. No. But at the end of the day, it's it's uh, you know it's really why why reinvent the wheel? You want to follow what other people have done, and you and the other thing I liked about your intro, which has always been in my in in my uh, processes as well, is leveraging my connections, leveraging my my network 
uh, ever since I was a kid. You know, my first my first entrepreneurial experience, I was in, I was uh, I built a paper wrap at, at age nine. By the age of twelve, I was I was featured on the front page of the newspaper and okay. built the biggest route they'd ever seen. And I did that by leveraging, you know, people around me. I had a buddies of mine that would do all the deliveries, help me do the deliveries. And I did what I was best at, which was knocking on doors, selling the subscriptions. And then I, in those days, we had to go back and, and do collections. We had to get paid. And because uh, there was no internet to pay your, your you know, your, your, your newspaper bill. So we had to go back, sell the subscription, then go back in every week and get paid for your weekly, you know, for the paper so I could pay the paper. Off. But, and then, uh, so anyway, it's always been about bringing partners together. I still have business partners today. I believe heavily in hiring people that are smarter than me to do jobs that I can't do myself. Most, I think many entrepreneurs make that big mistake. They they want to do it all themselves. They think they can do it all themselves. They're trying to can be control freaks and handle everything themselves. And at the end of the day, if you're not hiring others or outsourcing or getting some virtual assistants to help you support you and automate things, you are thinking too small and you will always be small if that's what you do. Yeah, I, I attribute all of that to, you know, when you say I can do it. So look, everyone that says I can do this myself, you probably could, but why? <laughs> You're going to spend 20 years reaching that goal of success versus three. Uh, and the, the one word that I attribute to anyone that has resistance to getting help is three letters and it's called ego. You know, we all have it. I have an ego. Marco has an ego. It's about putting it in check and controlling it and saying, you know what? I need to set that aside because I need help and I want to get help. Everyone wants to. They just don't want to admit that they can't. You know, they think it's an admission that they can't get it done themselves. Right. Is that what does that sound accurate, Marco? Yeah, I think so. You know, they and, and, and they feel like nobody can do it as good as I can. So, <laughs> you know, you've. you've... <laughs> Or, or, or they're being, you know, they're, they're, or they're thinking penny wise and pound foolish. They're, you know, they're being, I don't want to pay for that. So I'll do it myself, but it's just a, you're delaying the process because there's only so many hours in the day and you're not the expert on that. If you're not the expert at it, hire somebody who is. Exactly. Yeah. No, oh, how many times I've heard nobody can do it. Like I do it. And I'm like, that's exactly right. And that's actually probably a good thing. Because not because they're doing it wrong, but it's always good to have a different set of eyes and a brain looking at it a different way from a different lens, especially like you, Marco, and I, when we're, we're the head of our company or co-head or whatever, we're too, we're too associated with it to come up with the real creative ideas that typically you want people from the outside to look in and say, I like that about it. I don't like that about it. Not what you think, because what you think doesn't matter. It's what they think because they represent your client, your customer base. Right, right. Good, good point. And so I love, I love bringing on people to help me in in my business, VAs, apprentices, and I give them minimal direction. And I just say, just show me what what happens. I want to see the end result, and I do it lovingly. I don't say, ah, oh, I'm going to challenge you. If it sucks, you're gonna, I mean, you're done. I don't do that. It's like I just want to see what you got. And I said, you know what? I would never have done it that way, and that's why I love it. <laughs> right. That's cool. I didn't learn that right away, though, Marco, and I'm sure you didn't either. I mean, it sounds like you started off pretty darn good, though. <laughs> Man, you had you had the, your finger on the pulse of success from the very get go. And again, I hope people are writing notes. It's, you know, bring in help, leverage other people's um, experience, their genius or, you know, their their labor as well. Uh, right. No need to do this on your own other than. If you're just starting out and you're trying to build enough money to pay for them, I get that. We've all been there too, or at least I have. I don't oh, want to yeah, speak for sure. Marco. So yeah, um, I talked about body, you know, along with mind, and I'm curious for from your vantage point, Marco, because you know a lot of people think they either take care of their mind and go through uh, all of these self improvement type sessions and seminars and things. Those are great. Nothing negative to say about that. But then they'll say, well. I did that. So I really don't have to go exercise or if they exercise, take care of their body. It's like, well, I don't need to work on my mind because, you know, I've already got, I feel great, but really the mind and body are a team. And I like to say the, the mind and body are your team and they're listening to each other at all times. So if one's not, you know, banging on all cylinders, as I like to say, then the team as a whole is suffering. And so for you, when it comes to physical fitness, 
how high on a pedestal would you put that in your life as far as being important to you? Well, the older I get, the more important it's become. So, um, uh, <laughs> but I'm, I, I sometimes feel more physically fit than I did, you know, 20, 30 years ago because I was overweight or, you know, young when I was a younger man. And uh, right now I'm, I'm slim as, you know, thir- back to a 30, 30 inch waist. And uh, I'm, I swim uh, 30, 40 laps a day in my pool. I've got a pool built specifically for lap, you know, lap, lap, uh, lap swimming. And so I get some decent exercise in every day. To me, swimming is the best one there is. And so really put on a good effort of swimming uh, every day that I can. Uh, the weather is right. And uh, I'm out there swimming. And uh, uh, it makes a huge difference in, you know, controlling my diabetes that I happen to have. And, uh, you know, you, and eating right with my wife helps me do that. So, you know, making sure I'm eating right. And the, again, the older I get, the more I'm taking care of it because you realize that, Life is short and, and super short. You know, we, none of us know there's no promise of tomorrow. So we need to keep it, uh, the body healthy as possible so we can keep moving on and accomplishing our goals. Yep. Gone are the days of being a teenager and we're going to live forever, aren't they? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> like, goodness. I, I so resonate with what you just said completely, wholeheartedly. It's like I've become more conscious of all this than ever now as I get older. Think because. I'm noticing things aren't working the way they used to. You know, I got knees that hurt and uh, other things that go on. And you're like, what the heck was that? And I'd go to walk up the stairs and somehow my left foot didn't get up high enough. And I'm tripping over it myself. I'm like, I, I never had to think about this before. What's going on? Well, things, you know, you're aging. That's the bottom line. We're aging. And uh, yeah, you start thinking about preservation <laughs> and exactly. right. operate at a peak level of performance, though, for what, you know, what you and I are doing and other entrepreneurs you know, you're serving a lot of people and I know you want to be operating at your top, top level because a lot of people are depending on you, not just your employees, but also your clients. So and I, I definitely want to talk about let's let's do that now. So you are uh, a founder of Marketing Boost and it's an amazing, amazing. Uh, I call it a tool uh, for helping market a business. And I'll let you take it away on explaining what it is. Uh, Because this is amazing, and I hope everyone does take copious notes and writes down website uh, addresses and all this. Uh, But I want to hear it straight from the the master himself. Exactly what is Marketing Boost? How does it help companies? And if you have a success story or even two, feel free to to throw that in as well. I would love to hear about that. So I'll pull up the website as you uh, eloquently explain what it is Marketing Boost is all about. Thanks, Brian. So Marketing Boost is a, as you mentioned, a tool. Uh, It's a subscription service to be able for any small entrepreneur, big entrepreneur. We priced it at a price when we decided to go global that anybody could afford. So before I go explaining all of that it is, we'll start out with, hey, it's only $37 a month. So it's a no brainer to come on board as a member of Marketing Boost. Now, what do you get for $37 a month? We give you the ability to give away an unlimited amount of our travel incentives as your customer draw card. This is the tool to help you, you know, get clients to take action, to generate leads, to generate referrals, to generate uh, reviews, testimonials, video reviews. We'll talk about, a, you know, depending on how much time Brian gives me, I give you all kinds of ideas on how you can use these complimentary hotel stays that we offer in currently over 125 destinations around the world, like three nights in Las Vegas, three nights in Orlando, three nights in San Diego, five nights in Cancun, five nights in Hawaii, uh, seven nights in Phuket, Thailand, seven nights in Bali, 125 destinations. Plus we have hotel savings cards in increments of, these are like uh, different types of incentives, three different categories. So one is the complimentary trips, the other is hotel savings cards, They come in increments of $100, $200, $300, or $500 in cash credits that work like a gift card, but uh, a little bit differently. They don't pay down, they don't pay the entire hotel stay. They pay down the the price compared to Expedia's or what have you. They'll save you between 10 and 50% off compared to the Expedia's of the world. And then we have restaurant savings vouchers that can be. that are going to save you money at about a hundred thousand restaurants and businesses throughout the U S and Canada. And these are vouchers that can be given away as well. Unlimited as a member of marketing boost. 
So, you know, in here, who is our ideal client? I mean, the you know, people who use our services are business owners, sales managers, marketing managers, uh, affiliate marketers, multi-level marketers, uh, online, uh, online retailers or you know, business coaches, insurance, direct sales people, insurance agents, heck, even podcasters. I think I know somebody sitting right to my left. <laughs> Uh, Mr. Uh, Mr. Brian Kelly here, who uses has been using, I think, marketing moves. I think you told me earlier, almost probably almost three years, as one of his tools to generate to to as a as a lead uh, as a sweepstakes or a contest machine, so that he can capture the, the everybody who listens to his show. He can capture an email and a phone number or whatever he's asking for, so that he can remind you of his next show and where to find it and where to listen. So he's building a database. Using, I hope you don't mind me you, you mentioning this as you being one of the users of our service, Brian. Not at all. Okay, Absolutely. Cool. Yeah, and that's just one simple example. I mean, he's using it to to build the database. Uh, I, one of the ways he's using it, I suppose, is to build that database that he can continue to email and remind everybody of his up and coming shows and and what have you. But uh, you're looking at on the screen here a bunch of video testimonials that we've got. And uh, these are experts in all different fields. I mean, Greg Blazer there in the middle is a digital marketer, and he's been using it in, uh, in a million ways. Uh, Alex Vidal on the bottom there is an insurance agent who's made a ton of money. Tony Matthew there with, made over $500,000 with uh, as, a, as an agency. There's one guy, scroll up just a little bit. Let me show you. Here's an example, a guy named um, uh, Javier Rodriguez. His story is amazing. Javier has got tons of insurance agents under him. And what he came up with was a strategy of giving, of leading by giving. And this is something all of you could do if you were, uh, if you had access to marketing boost incentives. What he teaches his, his insurance agents all over the country that work under him to do is to support local nonprofits and fundraising, uh, you know, whether it's a local high school team that has to raise funds for, for the football equipment or a, uh, whatever charity he wants to, their teams wants to support, they'll go in and say, look, our company wants to sponsor your, your fundraiser. And we're going to give you six trips, you know, or 10 trips that we're paying for. We're going to give you these vacation certificates. You can auction them off and keep 100% of the money. So you can you know, do a blind auction or you can have a minimum bid for each of these certificates. And as the money comes in, you keep 100%. And, uh, and our company wants to sponsor the event. So you come across as the philanthropist, the, the, the good guy, the, the authority in the community with obviously you're an expert enough to be able to give away, you know, a dozen trips or whatever it is. And you're likely to end up with a with a with a, with an audience, a, a captive audience to the day of the auction to just give a quick elevator pitch as the sponsor of the event. Say, hey. Uh, I'm the expert in insurance and financial services, and so, or the realtor, or the you know pool supply company, or the, the we're the expert with you know uh, home roofing. I mean, you could do this for anything, and you can say, hey, if you ever need this or that and the other, look for me. You know, we're the experts on that. And in the meantime, enjoy the show, enjoy the bidding. I hope to you know can't wait to see who won the trips. I want to hand them out to you. And so that's just one simple way. That you can uh, you can use these incentives, and Brian, I could go on with so many success stories on how to use these incentives. But the key is is uh, you can, as a member for thirty seven, and this is you know I hate to call, sound like a sales pitch, but you can use these incentives to add value to your offers versus discounting. Right now, we many of us entrepreneurs we find ourselves competing. Everybody's an entrepreneur these days. You know, right now we have that big exit from people, you know, having jobs. Nobody wants to work, have a job anymore. We're all we're all home based entrepreneurs or, or, or something's going on because everybody's got nobody's available to work anymore. So I guess they all started a business. And um, but then you find yourself competing heavily with other everybody else and you find yourself wanting to discount the price just to stay competitive. And really, that's like a race to the bottom. You can go broke doing that. So uh, we find we've helped, you know, hundreds of our clients to hold their price and we've teach them to to add value, whether it be a marketing boost incentive or one of your own. Now, here's a tip. You can you can create value. But let's say you're a bit you're a gym, you know, instead of selling the 12 month membership, you might say, hey, 
Uh, if you sign up for 12 months, we'll give you the 13th and 14th month free. Or if you're a business coach, you might say, hire me for six months and I'll give you the seventh month free. So, you know, you can plug in your own your own value add incentives to whatever your offer is. Maybe I'm going to give you a, you know, a PDF. Uh, the book I wrote last year is included free. The different things that you might have done in the past, you can include free as, you know, to create that additional value add to your to your offers. But then... The travel incentives for Marketing Boost are right now, especially right now, they're incredibly popular. Uh, timing is perfect. I mean, over the last year and a half or so, people, some of our members were gun shy. Well, who's going to want a travel incentive during COVID? But believe it or not, those that were using it were still very successful with them because people still knew eventually I'm going to want to get out of my house and travel. And right now, I call it revenge travel. People are... <laughs> I've never seen I've never seen so much of these certificates being handed out, so many of them being activated, so many of them being used. It's just like crazy. People are really, really tired of lockdowns, tired of you know masking up, and we're all ready to go somewhere and take a trip. So uh, in a minute, I guess if Brian lets me, I'll tell you how this business even came about. Oh my goodness! Well, we have to do that real quick. I want to give a shout out to a good friend of mine, Don Hopperich. He's a he leads a chamber of commerce here local to where I live, and he's an amazing servant of other businesses. And good evening to you too, Don. He says, good evening, Brian and Marco. Good to be here with you both tonight, and it's good to be here with you as well, my friend. I appreciate you for coming on. Yeah, uh, and so many ideas. Don, I, I'll bet your, your wheels are turning for everyone that's in the chamber of commerce right now. Uh, every person could use this. Uh, it's phenomenal. And Marco's just barely touch the surface on the ways and the, and the means that you can use this. Uh, as you see, I'm uh, this show is being sponsored by the Big Insider Secrets. It's actually a very close friend of mine, Jason Nast, who is using, guess what? Marketing Boost. <laughs> and that is how we are able to give away a vacation stay. I could give away 10, 15, 20. Uh, so in, that's the beautiful thing I love about, uh, there's so many things I love about it, but not being not worrying about oh my gosh if i do another one it's going to cost me extra no uh, i use this as another example marco if i may real quick is i do a master class every three weeks on how to do live video and in it i give away gifts so leading up to it uh part of the pull in the the landing page it's free i don't charge anything for it but i i tell them that five people will be randomly selected uh to win a five night stay at a five-star luxury resort so I use it in various different ways. Uh, and one way is you could use it and be a sponsor like the Big Insider Secrets. Yet another way to think out of the, outside of the box, just like Marco was saying with the fundraising. It, it's phenomenal. It's a it's a it's just a slam dunk. And come on, 37 a month. That's nothing. And you'll want to stay to the end for two reasons. One is you get to see one implementation of how you can use his very uh, system and his service. And two, he has a gift as well. You don't want to go anywhere. Stay to the end because we got gifts galore coming out. And that's what Marco is all about. Give, give, give. Yes. So tell me, how did this whole thing come about? I can't wait to hear that. So back in, uh, we, we were in, been in the travel space, my partner and I, uh, and I for, for years. So we launched it. We had a, a travel website we were very successful with. And we wanted to generate some video testimonials. We're trying to scratch our head. How can we get people to do selfie videos, uh, you know, from the hotels, from the resorts and, you know, brag about the hotel brand and brag about our brand. And uh, so we could leverage the video testimonials you know, and, and turn them into thousands of additional sales, which is eventually what we did. So we came up with this idea of and here's the tip. Here's the uh, when I'm done with this, you, you know, you're going to love this idea, Brian. Here's a tip that any business can use, regardless of whether or not you're using marketing boost incentives. You need reviews. We all need reviews for whatever business we're in. We need testimonials. And if you got video testimonials, it's even more powerful than anything else. If you had, you know, several dozen video testimonials, we now have over 30,000 video testimonials from people that have traveled to our hotels and resorts around the world, more than any other travel website anywhere. And, uh, and here's how we did it. We did a survey when we expected folks to be at their happiest the day after checking in. 
So we would do a, a, a an e and mind you, you believe in automation, so do I. I we, one of the upsell products that Marketing Boost offers is an automation platform, but I believe you, you've offered that as well, so get it from Brian. But the point is, automation is required here. So we'd set up an automation to send people a message going, hey, we're, you're, uh, how is, you know, have you checked in by now? How's the hotel living up to your standards? Uh, on a scale of one to five, how does that hotel live up to your expectations? How is our service uh, coming about so far? And uh, if, if they gave us back a four or five, uh, we would immediately, automatically with automation, send them back a message saying, thank you so much. We're so glad you're having a wonderful trip so far. We need to ask you a huge favor. Would you please help us spread the word about that hotel and our service? And give us, if you would give us a video review from the beach or the pool or the bar or what have you, and do a selfie video and brag about their hotel brand and ours, if you do that, we're going to reward you with a complimentary hotel stay on us, a bonus trip, three nights in your choice of Orlando or Las Vegas. That's how we started. And that took off. Before we knew it, we were getting dozens and then hundreds of these video testimonials coming in, and we were leveraging them all over our website, turning them into thousands of additional dollars in sales. And I mind you, people, most people are never going to, here's the, the deal here. People are not going to watch all those video testimonials, but the fact that you have them is social proof that yes. will outweigh anything in writing because all the written reviews, people are like, well, they could have been written by the owner. They could have paid somebody to write them, you know, but video reviews, you know, they're hard to fake. So, uh, and so they're, you know, there, we had them and we were leveraging them. So again, that's the, the, you know, value bomb there is you need to solicit reviews. And one of the ways to do it is with a, you know, a marketing boost incentive. But if you don't ask for reviews, guess what? You're only going to get the reviews when people are upset. It's like, it's like, you know, most of us expect to be happy when we buy a product or service. So we don't ever get around to writing a positive, you know, a review for them. Most of us don't anyway, until, unless we're upset. If we're not happy, then we want to tell everybody in the world. So you're likely to end up, you know, at some point with some negative reviews if you're doing a lot of volume. And so you, you know, you want to make sure that you are doing your best to do that, that survey. When you find out they're happy with you, then you're going to ask them, solicit those people. You're, they're your, your brand evangelists get them to give you a, you know, post various reviews, make it easy for them, send them the links where you need the reviews. You can throttle them to site jabbers, shopper approved, you know, Google my business, uh, Facebook, and you can have those reviews automatically going to different, different areas so that Google finds them and post you, you know, right up on top. So that's the idea there. Now, the other good news on that survey, if they did give you a two or a three or something, you need to know about it as well. So you can jump on it, solve the problem, and make the customer happy. And in that case, anyway, I, I forgot about why I was told that story. The story was to tell you how Marketing Boost was born. So this was, a we, we were giving away these trips. And when people started raising their hands saying they wanted to use that free trip, we promised, well, now we're having to pay for them out of pocket. So we're having to write checks, you know, to pay for these hotel bills to send everybody on the free trip we promised. We thought, well, this is expensive. We were making money on it, you know, from... <laughs> <laughs> this idea was expensive. We had to do something. So we reached back out to our hotel partners and we said, you look, we, we know you've got a problem and we can fix it. You have a problem that we know between you and I and the four, you know, four walls around us here. We know your hotel is never full year round. You have unsold rooms. You 70% of the year. I mean, you're full for weekends. You're full for holidays. You're full on special events. You're full for Easter week, et cetera. But 70% of the year, 30% of the rooms go empty. And uh, so we can put help you put warm bodies in those rooms. We can put couples in those rooms that are going to spend money at the restaurant, the bar, the casino, the spa, the, 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 the room service. You know, they're going to spend money on the hotel. They're going to book extra nights. They're going to upgrade room types and so on. And so you're going you're gonna to generate some revenue versus none on the 30% of the year. And I mean, 30% of those empty rooms. So a few of them decided to participate. And that's how we were fulfilling our own trips that we were giving away. And then we decided, wow, if we grew this, if we had, you know, instead of just two destinations giving us free rooms, if we had 100 of them, we could turn this into a standalone business and offer this to, you know, business owners all over the world, which is what we ended up doing. We went out and found those relationships we already had with it as a high volume travel, you know, business. 
We went out and solicited. Now we have 125 destinations participating, hundreds of hotels that are in the mix. And uh, and as you as you use Brian right now, some of them are even are phenomenal. Like in Cancun right now, we've got a a triple A rated four diamond family of resorts called the Fives in Cancun, Riviera Maya area, Playa del Carmen, Puerto Morales. These are you know the the one in Playa del Carmen's 15 restaurants and bars, oceanfront, triple A, four diamond you know resort like you say five star. And, uh, you know, you can't go wrong with this property. It's an amazing resort. So I would recommend if you join Marketing Boost, give yourself a free trip to Cancun and experience this for yourself so that you can be an evangelist for this for, for our brand and start using this to grow your business in one way or another. There's a million ways to use these incentives. Uh, okay, that was a lot of incredible wisdom. It's time. Yes. Dropping smart bombs, knowledge bombs, bombs of wisdom, and you added value bomb. I like that one too. Definitely. <laughs> oh my gosh. And did you catch that? You you uh, watchers and listeners, uh, the audience that, did you catch that last idea? Give yourself a free trip? <laughs> oh my. I mean, $37 a month. If you were to pay for it for a year, that's still not enough to pay for what the equivalent is in one trip, I would imagine. That's so, correct. Wow. Uh, so there's so many different ways you can utilize this, but uh, obviously for businesses, this is genius. So thank you for coming up with this whole concept, Marco. I'm glad. And thank you for the backstory. That was pretty cool. Uh, I, I, you know, I wonder things like that. How the heck are they able to do this? And, you know, for such a small monthly fee, it's unbelievable. But there are secrets in every industry. And like you pointed out, you know, they have a 30% open, you know, no capacity. Uh, people not aren't uh, staying all the time throughout the year. So they have open. And so I like to always say this during the show when I bring it up as the prize giveaway is that this is a bona fide trip. So Marco, you can definitely uh, chime in on this as well, because what I always say is you're not going to be, you know, you're not going to be greeted and then pulled down into the basement where they have a water drip torture machine. And then they pitch you on a timeshare or anything like that. Uh, and I know this to be true because I know the Jason Nast, the CEO of the Big Insider Secrets, who provides this for us, that he's gone three times. He's tested it and said it's it's just like you're another person going on vacation. It just happens to be paid for. <laughs> right, right. Yeah. No, thank yeah, you thank for you. pointing that out. So, yeah, there's no one. When we decided to do this, we really decided we're going to revolutionize this industry and totally turn it upside down. We're not the first to be in the, the travel incentive business. Travel certificates have been around for decades. Uh, you know, you've probably seen, you know, when you want a free cruise or this or that, the other. But most of all of our competitors, really, there are several things they do that we find to be done very wrong. One, the certificates can be expensive. I've seen them sold for as much as, you know, $100 each. So it gets uh, costly to be given away the you know these 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 trips. Two, they our competitors typically make them nearly impossible to use. The whole idea is for you to not use them. They'll make you have sixty days advance notice to travel. They'll um, they'll have stuff like well, you got to choose. You give us two travel dates that you'd like to go. They got to be ninety days apart. Uh, essentially, they're trying to make it difficult for you to use the incentive. With us, uh, we, we decided to do, and or they have timeshare promotions attached to them, like you said. And so we decided, no, one, there's no timeshare required ever with any of our incentives. Uh, two, there's um, we make it affordable for the business owner because it's only $37 a month. And three, for the consumer who uses the incentive, there's, uh, again, it's easy to use. There's uh, a, a, an online platform after they activate the certificate, they can immediately just click on that and check the dates they, they're available and book the hotel, get instant confirmation, instant gratification. Now, we are filling what would be other, you know, unsold rooms. So there, there's going to be about 35 to 40 weeks a year of availability out of 52. So they're not going to be available for, available for, for peak uh, seasons, uh, Christmas week. You're not going to get a, uh, you know, a, go snow uh, skiing in Aspen during ski season. In other words, there's going to be some, they don't need our help. The hotels don't need our help in either peak seasons or holidays or Christmas week or New Year's Eve or, you know, uh, 4th of July, stuff like that. So uh, as long as you and your client can be somewhat flexible, there, there's going to be plenty of availability. Uh, the other thing that I should disclose here is a couple of rules. Like there's some, there are government taxes that need to be paid on these rooms. 
The government's always going to have their hand out, no matter where around the world. They're expecting their government fees, taxes, or tourism fees. And so uh, we have what we call an activation fee, which is paid up front. And then the then after it's activated by those activation fee covers the government taxes and fees. And mm-hmm. then your client has 18 months to travel. Now, you as a business owner can pay that activation fee if you want to. Uh, you can fund your wallet and marketing boost and pay for it or do what most of us do is we let the client pay the taxes and we just do a proper disclosure. So when we're giving away the free trips, we're telling people, hey, you know, you're I'm giving you the hotel rooms. You're up. You know, you're going to be responsible for airfare, food and beverage and government taxes and fees. And so you, you know, do a disclosure, a basic, simple thing. And um, it's uh, everybody's happy with it. I mean, we have thousands of these being uh, activated a, a week and, and used. So it's it's very, very, very effective for many, many business owners. I love it. I was going to pull up a site to give an example of what you said with the disclaimers, because that's exactly what we do and put a disclaimer that um, that you, you need to pay the resort fees, we call them, I think. Um, and that's it. Uh, but you also need to supply your own travel to and from. So if it's a long way away, and you need to hop in a plane. That's not covered. It's the hotel stay. Uh, but you can choose something nearby. I live in California. I could choose Vegas. I can drive there. It's not a big deal. Um, but I don't want to go to Vegas anymore. I want to go to the exotic location. So right. I'll get in a plane. I, I'm not, I have no problem with that. Uh, this is phenomenal. And I just love how, you know, it's nobody thinks anything negative about travel unless they're doing it for work. But, you know, this is for leisure. And it, it's just a great, from every vantage point, you're giving something away and it's something that people want and they're going to enjoy it. And they, they just... They jump through hoops. So, like you talked about the uh, the legal bribe that you give for testimonials, perfect use case for it. Um, I love that. And yeah, giving away for incentives like I'm doing on the show. Stick around to the end because you want to enter to win that five night stay at a five star luxury resort. So you can use that as a strategy in your own podcasts or live shows to get better retention of viewers. Now they may walk around the house and come back and check in knowing that it's an hour long show and then say, man, I hope I didn't miss it, but at least you're getting the, the retention nonetheless. But I think with people like Marco coming on this show, that doesn't happen. They, they're glued to the, to their, their set at the whole, at all times. Um, this is a uh, phenomenal. So I don't even know if I, 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 I'm so deeply curious. I've got to ask the question. It may be super obvious and I may look like a goofball asking it, because what you're doing is is helping people to market their business in so many creative, wonderful ways. But for you, Marco, so you know what you used to do 10 years ago to market your business probably isn't the go-to way today because marketing seems to change what is successful uh, over the course of years, kind of like the real estate market. It's always going up and down. Uh, so for you, like right now, because it could be different than it was before, how what has been the most successful form for you to market your business uh if you could name one technique or strategy that you would say that's it this is my go-to this is what's working for us now well it, for years it's been it's been facebook marketing it's been uh i mean early on i've been i've been an internet marketer since 1996 so i've been uh, playing with watching the rebel the, evol- the evolving marketing programs were available online. I was involved before e- before before Facebook, before Google, uh, and so on. But you know, pay per click used to be bread and butter. Google used to be you know pay per click on Google and everything else was the main stay for many years. And then they changed the rules. They took off. They made it harder for for the average you know for smaller businesses to play. And then it became, you know, Facebook. So we've been marketing on Facebook for decades, for almost, a, you know, 10 years right now. I spent over $70 million on Facebook ads with for the, for all of our different brands combined. So uh, I should have been on a private flight with, with uh, Zuckerberg, but never did. But, <laughs> um, but uh, and that's changed recently dramatically. Again, another change kicking in because of the uh, relationship with Apple and iOS 14, iOS 15 coming out. That's made it harder to target advertising on Facebook. So we're you know moving to different strategies. Uh, we're doing you know more of um, of TikTok and 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 
and YouTube and and back to pay per click and you know just mixing it all up. Uh, text messaging has been huge for me, by the way. Going back, to simple email and text messaging still works. Uh, so you've got to build that email database and you've got to you know have relevant content and, and be emailing and. Again, it's an affordable way to get, stay in touch with your with your and revive it. One of the things you can use Marketing Boost for is to revive an old kind of dead database too. You can run contests and so forth to uh, to create you know to get people back involved with uh, with your with your opening their emails again. Uh, text messaging is huge if used properly and and you know when, with relevant content. And uh, one thing I'm doing right now is getting myself on interviewed on podcast shows like yours, Brian. I'm using the podcast world and getting myself interviewed now uh, on two and three, four or five shows uh, a week. I sometimes do three shows a day. So I, I, I enjoy the podcasting because it's an opportunity to get spread, you know, my my story on in other people's audiences and what have you. And I find that to be now working very well as well. That is a huge one right there. And that is something that is working quite well right now. Uh, so it has been, um, it, it's interesting because podcasting is, you know, for people that don't recognize, there is a difference between a podcast and a live video show. A podcast is a traditional audio recorded only and then edited after the fact kind of thing. So I liken a podcast kind of like to the old dial with push button radio that we had in our car and our old Chevy pickups that Marco and I are the only two that ever saw one of those. Cause we're only, only too old enough to know, but that's what podcasting is a very, very old technology yet today. It's a very new way of marketing and very successful. And I've seen and heard so many people just like yourself, Marco on the success that you're getting from being on podcasts and your strategy, the way you're doing it as being a guest, I, I would highly recommend everybody do that everybody uh if you're not you know if you don't feel like you have the chops to put you know stand up your own show you don't want to mess with all the stuff that goes behind the scenes you don't have to you just show up and follow some simple instructions marco followed him to a team my god he came on his lighting was perfect his mic was perfect his hair was perfect i mean everything and uh you know so what a great uh resource and we met i'll say it out loud we met you and i on podmatch of all places and I saw it and I saw marketing boost. I'm like, oh my gosh, I know who this guy is. Uh, my buddy uses his services and oh, this is going to be fun. And that wasn't long before. Oh my gosh, we got another great one. Okay, so we need another video testimonial from my good friend, Don. I want to read this to you because this is uh, powerful. He said, just want to let you know, I've been part of marketing boost for a couple of years now. And before I started to use the service and promote it, I had to check them out. Took me a year to be 100% convinced, but since it has been a great part of my giveaway shows and our members really like the opportunities to use the travel incentives. So, yeah, straight from another very astute businessman. Uh, I thought sure. I recog I thought I recognized that name, Don, with uh, with, with uh, as a member because I think he won a contest for marketing booths not too long ago for something, and uh, uh, I don't know if I think he won a an ipad or something that for doing for you know something i don't remember exactly what but i thought i recognized the name so that's awesome yeah he's yeah he's a sweetheart of a man and he's he really cares about the businesses in our, in our area and he goes out of his way i've never seen anyone uh so wonderfully giving and uh just wants uh other businesses to thrive that he he takes it to heart i love i love the people i, I get to know and and uh, hang out with uh, Marco, we're just going to have to like maybe meet in the middle. You're in Florida. I'm in California. We can just both move to Texas and hang out, right? Yeah, that'd be good. <laughs> <laughs> right in the middle. This is uh, this is fantastic. Oh, my goodness. I just checked the clock. Oh, I cannot believe we are this far into it. All right. So it's exciting. I want to I'm going to ask Mr. Torres a very profound question to end the show. We're not quite there yet. Uh, so don't go anywhere. But I did promise everyone that if they stay to the end and we're close enough to make this happen now because you get to see his incredible uh, system being used and how it's being used from our vantage point and give you some ideas. So every one of you who are watching this live right now should enter to win for a five night vacation stay at a five star luxury resort, compliments of the big insider secrets and really marketing boost. And uh, to do that, all you have to do is go to a particular website. So for this, 
write this down. Remember what I said in the opening show, write it down. Don't go there yet. You'll have plenty of time. Uh, we don't process the winner till like an hour after the show's over. Anyway, you have plenty of time to do it once we uh, hit the end broadcast button. So here it is. I'll put it up on the screen for those of you watching live. Here's how you enter. Write this down. You want to go to ryp.im forward slash vacation. Just go to ryp.im forward slash vacation. All you have to do is enter your information. It's an opt-in form. So it's your, your name, email address, your cell number, and just hit submit. And don't worry. We are not going to hit you with endless spam mails about selling you anything. In fact, what's going to happen is you're going to be put on a list that you can leave at any time that's going to let you know when our next show goes live. That's all we're going to message you with, uh, promise. Unless you become the winner, we'll get you'll get a little bit more messaging because we're going to show you how to go get your prize. And that's where you're going to see the brilliance of this man's uh, whole operation in, in work. It's going to be phenomenal. I can't wait. In fact, I'm going to do something I've never done before, Marco, on this show. And it's, it's in your honor. Everyone who enters wins. How's that? But you have to be. Oh, gosh. If that isn't a moment, I don't know what is. Yes. <laughs> Mic drop. You have to be watching this live. You have to be watching this live. So after this is done, it's recorded. That's no longer going to happen. I, I know when they come in, they're all time stamped. So uh, enter to win and you're and you've won, period. All because of this man. You have him to think, not me. So appreciate you, Marco, for that. And we have another gift from Marco. And then we're going to drop that big question in just a second uh, before I do that. All right. We have somebody that's excited about that. Yes, Phoenix Rising Travel Services. I love this. <laughs> she says, yeah. All right. Fantastic. So what I want to do is uh, also Mr. Torres has a phenomenal gift that he wants to offer all of you. You know, he has a phenomenal service and, you know, it's only thirty seven dollars a month. Well, he's going to even further blow your mind. So I'm going to let him take the reins and explain what it is he's about to give away. I'm going to put it up on the screen. Go cool. ahead. I got a special go. offer, special offer for listeners to this show. You go to marketingboost.com forward slash podcast. You can get 30 days of Marketing Boost for only $1, all right? Just giving it away for a dollar for an entire 30 days and uh, test it out. Navigate your way around. Check it all out. See what it can see. Get some, See if you get some ideas. When you join, you ought to book a, we have a free onboarding training call that you can take a brainstorming session with one of our experts to walk you through exactly how you might use the incentives for your unique business and uh, and we'll walk you through it. And then I'd give yourself a free trip to Cancun <laughs> while you're at it. So marketingboost.com forward slash podcast and get marketing boost for 30 days for a single dollar bill. A free a vacation stay in Cancun for a buck. I mean, this guy's good at sales, isn't he? And a dollar, <laughs> come on. And then 37 a month after that. It's uh, it's a no brainer. What an amazing, amazing giveaway. I'm going to say it one more time. Uh, for those of you that might listen, be listening on podcast, it's marketingboost.com forward slash podcast. And podcast is all lowercase. Of all the words there, podcast is the most important that you make it all lowercase. Uh, marketingboost.com forward slash podcast. And get your subscription started for a dollar. And then enjoy your trip to Cancun or wherever you want to go that they offer 100 and what'd you say? 120 some destinations, 125 destinations to choose from. Yep. So <laughs> uh, we have, we have people having fun. Uh, she says, thank you, Marco. And then this, this she's, I know she's half kidding. Can I end my subscription? I think she subscribes and then Can I end and start oh. over for a dollar. <laughs> <laughs> That's oh, good. Lord. I can tell she's having fun and getting around a little bit there. Mm -hmm. um, and it's been a joy having you on this show, uh, Marco. I appreciate you for spending your valuable time. And with this, I want to end it, end it on a really high note. And this question always makes that happen. It's a very profound question. It can be a little personal. But I ask every, every guest the same exact question before we call it an evening. Uh, the good thing is... 
there is no such thing as a wrong answer, Marco. Okay. It does not exist. In fact, it's the exact the exact opposite is the truth, is that the only correct answer is yours. And the reason is, is because it's going to be unique to you. And that's really the only thing that makes it even a hint of being personal. It's just uh, because it's unique to you. And so when I ask the question, you may have the answer like that. Or you may need to ponder for a few seconds or minutes. Either way is just fine. Why? Because it's your answer and it's the right one. It doesn't matter. There's no failing on this whatsoever. It's so I get a lot of people get nervous because I build yeah, it up. A little you got bit. me nervous. So shit. I'm, sweating. <laughs> I'm sweating over here. <laughs> I love it. Oh, we got another. I want to see. Yes, Phil. Thank you. So one more comment from a viewer who says, thank you. I 100% believe in video reviews, and I'm pretty sure we use the same reviews system. So very cool. Yeah, it's a big brotherhood and sisterhood. All right. So, Marco, are you ready Absolutely. for the big question? Shoot, before I <laughs> sweat my pants off here. <laughs> All right, here we go. Marco Torres, how do you define success? Success for me is defined as uh, helping. Uh, when I help other people sow seeds, for me, sowing success is helping sow the seeds of success in others. So when I help, when I help other people, you know, plant the seeds of success in them and then help them you know, as those as those seeds grow and their businesses grow, and then I together I can share in the enjoyment of the harvest. So I enjoy you know seeing and helping people and getting their 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 stories and and uh, being a part of it. You know, I, the business. The, my mission in life right now is how many business owners can I help around the world uh, grow their business, even if it's a little bit or a lot. And I've had you know. People that one guy comes to mind and helped to make an additional million dollars thanks to Marketing Boost. So mm -hmm. it 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 feels good to know that we are helping others and um, and that by the way we also donate with every uh, every one of those X certificates that's activated. Uh, we are donating to a cause of planting a tree for every donation. So we're helping plant more trees around the world and uh, helping with sustainable tourism as well. So that's my the definition of success. All right. And you know what's coming, don't you? Yes. One more time. <laughs> Thanks. Oh, yeah. Thank you. Marco Torres, the man, the myth, the legend, the one behind marketingboost.com. So be sure to take him up on that offer for $1 for your first month. You can go almost anywhere in the world that they have a, a deal with hotels, 120 plus destinations. So Oh my gosh, this has been, I've been looking forward to this one, Marco, and it lived up to my expectations. Uh, in fact, I think you surpassed them. So I appreciate you for coming on, sharing your wisdom, your value, and your service, because your service in itself is a huge value to businesses. And that's why I didn't think it was, I didn't feel like a pitch to me. It felt like this is a great marketing resource for businesses to help them build their list and make their customers happy. And it's a win-win. And for $37 a month, come on, man, that's that's nothing. So appreciate you, my brother. If you have one final parting thought you'd like to give to a budding entrepreneur or someone who's in the beginning stages getting getting out of the chute, if you can think of something looking back on what you've been through and your experience to date, what would be one piece of advice that just jumps to the top of your head immediately to say, this is what I'd like to help you with? Yeah, I've got a, I happen to have a book right next to me here that I reach out that I, that I use a lot. And uh, you, if you haven't read it yet, you might want to add it to your library at reach your peak library. And it's called, if you can see it on the screen here, hypnotic writing. Ah, I got it blurry here for whatever reason, hypnotic writing by Joe Vitale, hypnotic oh. writing by Joe Vitale. I love this book because it's a resource I use often over and over uh, when I'm writing content, when I'm writing an email newsletter, when I'm writing uh, a sales page for a, a sales funnel page for myself or one of my clients, uh, which uh, we help do, by the way. But anyway, the the, the book is full of, of nuggets to help to help you write in a hypnotic way. And what they mean by that in the book is 
where you lead people from one paragraph to the next and then to the next, where they just want to stay engaged and keep reading until you, you, you persuade them to do whatever it is you were trying to get them to do, whether it's, whether it's purchase your product or service or, you know, follow you or again, whatever you're trying to accomplish. So it's a great book to read. You're, you're not really hypnotizing anybody, but that's the idea. It's hypnotic writing. It's the, 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 the skill of, of writing engaging copy and that can help any business i mean even whether you're writing sales letters or writing your resume the book can be can be a, a big asset to you that's awesome i met him in person is going back wow oh, a long time ago 15 or so years ago uh dr joe vitelli and uh mark joiner was there it was his go uh, farewell party i don't know if you've heard of him but he's been coined the godfather of uh, internet marketing. Uh, just an amazing group of people back then. Joel Christopher, who was the master list builder, was there. So many people that I, I befriended and, and got to know. And Dr. Joe Vitelli was there. He was a phenomenal, wonderful guy. You know, I talked to him out in the hallway for a while. So I love that reference. And I have not read that book. Shame on me. So I'm going to go get that book next. And that's one, one parting uh, piece of advice that I would like to give to everyone is that when you hear people like Marco Torres, who has achieved such a great level of success, it doesn't even matter what level it is, just maybe if it's a little bit more than yours, you always want to get to the next level. Listen to others, especially when they recommend a book. And when they recommend a book, like when we got off the, the, the stage here tonight, I'm going to go to Audible and I'm going to order that book. I hope it's in Audible form. I love listening. Uh, and, and it'll be in my library and it'll be there to be plucked up as one of the next reads that I go for. So just a word of advice to everyone. When you hear a book that is being uh, touted by someone successful like Marco, then and if you haven't read it, then go get it. I mean, do not waste a moment. Go get it right when the show's over or, or podcast or whatever, wherever you found or heard about it from. So that's my last piece of advice. Marco Torres, I'm not going to hold you any longer. I know it's getting late over there in that wonderful state of Florida. And uh, I want to give you the respect you deserve and, uh, you know, respect your time and everyone who's been watching and listening, respect you madly as well. Love you all. Don't forget to enter. You all will win a vacation stay. All you have to do is enter ryp.im forward slash vacation. There, I said it one last time, enter to win. And I can't wait to uh, announce all the winners on Facebook or wherever. We're going to have some fun with it. All right, Marco, that's it for me on behalf of this amazing, amazing man. Did you have something to say before I called it a night? I was going to say, stay thirsty, my friend. Stay thirsty for knowledge. <laughs> stay thirsty. <laughs> I love it. I am thirsty. I'm going to I'm going to take a drink while we're right after. Yeah. All right. <laughs> On behalf of the amazing Marco Torres, I am your host, Brian Kelly of the Mind Body Business Show. We'll be back again next week with another. Actually, we'll be back in a couple of days. We have another show coming up on Thursday, a rare two twofer. I love it. Uh, so be sure to enter to win. You'll get notified of when that show comes on and who's going to be on it automatically. So we're looking forward to seeing you all back here again then. Until then, so long and be blessed. Take care, everybody. Thank you for tuning in to the Mind Body Business Show podcast at www.themindbodybusinessshow.com. My name is Brian Kelly.